um, the date you need to write like this topic tenses and here I have mentioned specially proverb I want once you come back to the school you need to write the proverb on the top every day one proverb but not the same proverb this is one of my favorite proverb never give up in the classrooms I want you all should represent different kind of idioms or proverb so that in the end of the month you will come to know you have written 30 different proverbs which just add in your vocabulary and then next we have a day obviously like I have explained you yesterday and let's start with the recapitulation yesterday we have done this tense father three sons present past future and each son have how many grandchildren one two three four so it's a recapitulation now let's start our part one that is rules for present tense now present tense I explained you how many children four simple continuous perfect perfect continuous now you can easily understand like in your family you all are not liking the same vegetables same pulses or you can say the same dessert so same in this case simple continuous perfect present perfect continuous they have different different choices what simple likes the most you can read it here subject plus s or e s subject means the main heading he she the subject is the starting part of the sentence for an example rock wants to sing now a simple question ma'am why s here it is very very clear when here it is a singular with singular will always add s or es if it was plural here we never add s or es here now what is the choice of continuous continuous like am is are plus first form plus ing I will explain you these all the forms but let's go for the example Peter is coming to our place Peter is coming coming is the first form first form second form third form come came come this is the clear circle you can see here with first form only we can use ing Gaming is not a word. If you can ask me ma'am, we can add ing with the third form. Sorry, we can never add ing with the third form. Now next son is perfect. The clear rule for perfect is have, has. You can see a clear circle here. Ma'am, why have? Ma'am, why has? Where to use have and where to use has? So my dear children, Jab zada log honge, we will always use have. Jab ek hoga, we will always use has. They have, we have means zada. She has, he has means one. Plus third form of the verb. Third form means big, bigger, biggest. The third number, biggest. Biggest is the third form. Now let's read the example of this perfect. They have. Now here you can clearly see zada more more ke saath we'll always use have children's wherever you see have or has just close your eyes and say yes this is perfect tense this is perfect tense why because have is written here they have written write wrote written written is the third form you can see clearly here three letters or whatever that is the predicate now last son is present perfect continuous it is a blend children you know the meaning of blend like a mango shake mango shake means you have to add on perfect plus you have to add on continuous or jab dono ka shake banao ge na usme add karne ke liye aapko honey chahiye you all know honey we get honey from bee honey bee so always remember ma'am ne samjhaya tha bee or bee yaha hame help karega bean me so you will never ever forget bean whenever you just write the sentence by using present continuous you always remember have has been been is must 
while writing the sentence of perfect continuous has have been plus first form plus ing why ing because here continuous continuous means close your eyes and just remember continuous means ma'am ne samjhaya tha ing to hoga hi hoga us sentence mein lisa has now again the example come lisa is one girl with one we always use has lisa has been living first form in this area for 20 years so my dear children i'm just showing you this clip one more time and i want you should write in your notebook like this only one page one rule this is the summary of you know present tense and here you can see degrees of comparison jinko nahi pata hai first form second form third form i have written few examples rest you can search from your google sweet sweeter sweetest first form sweet second form sweeter third form sweetest so these four examples are for you rest you can search in abund abundant of examples in google and somewhere else now tomorrow i will discuss with you rules of past tense every day we will cover up these rules and my dear friends believe me if you go one day day by day these tenses will be like a fun for you just mere it is your fear that oh my god these are very tough these are very tough first of all i want you should learn this like the formulas of mathematics like in mathematics you cannot change your formulas so my dear children tenses may be ye jo rules hain you are not going to change it where it is written subject plus s or es there you are supposed to write subject plus s or es you cannot mix the continuous with simple you cannot mix the perfect with continuous rules are clear why i am pausing this video here so i am just want to give you a few time to write down and see you tomorrow stay inside safe life use more sanitizer and just relax and pray to god that we will come back to our school as soon as possible thank you and have a wonderful day